We got that on video. <laughs> nice. I hope you guys enjoyed that intro to the video. That was a first. <laughs> she didn't know it, but she does now. Um, <laughs> so, hey guys, my name is Jason Lanier. I'm here in Maui, Hawaii with uh, Knit Cirk Melchor, also known as Kristen. Um, and uh, we're here to do a test today between the uh, Canon 50mm 1.2 uh, with the Metabones adapter and the uh, Sony Zeiss 55 1.8. After I released my video with the uh, with the Canon lens, a lot of people had questions on, uh, well, what's better, the Zeiss or the Canon? So uh, I like both lenses. A lot of people complained about chromatic aberration on the Canon. I guess that's a frequent issue. I have never shot with Canon lenses, so it's not like uh, I've had that issue come up before. I will tell you on that video I did not do any sort of chromatic aberration uh, adjustments I didn't do anything in Lightroom to try and fix that so I just edited it the way I normally edit my Sony shots or my Nikon shots so let the chips fall where they may so at any rate we're gonna put the Metabones on here with the Canon 50 millimeter and we're gonna then we're gonna use the uh, Sony uh, 55 Zeiss um, now I'm shooting both these on the a7R2 today and then I am gonna do some videos with the a7 II. I want to make something clear uh, if you're expecting professional type results or performance from any of the other uh, Sony mirrorless cameras with the Metabones adapter, you're not going to find it. It's only going to work well on the A7R2 or the A7 II. So if you try it on other ones, you're going to you're not going to like it unless you're totally into manual focus. If you're into manual focus, then just buy a cheap adapter. Don't buy the Metabones. Buy like a Photodiox, like $80 one, $60 one, and go to town. But if you're looking for autofocus performance, that's interesting. You keep never mind. That totally can't make it in the video. If you're looking for autofocus performance, it's either going to be on the A7R2 or the A7 II and not any of the other Sony mirrorless. So, without further ado, let's get started because the more I talk, the worse it gets. Hi, I'm Kristen. You can follow me on Knitzerk Melcher. That's why I call her Knitzerk. So. Right. We're going to start with the 55 Zeiss. I'm going to shoot both of them at 1.8. The Metabones Mark IV that I have only goes down to 1.3. And it doesn't shoot at 1.8, it shoots at 1.7 or 2.0. So. That's how I'm going to compare the lenses. Uh, so it's not complete apples to apples, but it's the closest we can get. So I'm going to uh, do some shots today with the 55 Zeiss at 1.8 and then uh, go to the Canon and you guys can make up the best decision for you as to what works for you and your needs. Set up the 55 Zeiss, love the results. Um, obviously it's a native lens, so the autofocus is gonna be really quick. Um, I autofocus, you only get that with the native lenses, you're not gonna get that with the uh, Metabones, but you will get face, facial recognition with both. And to me, the facial recognition is even more important than the eye autofocus, so, um, well, I'm just gonna let you guys see them side by side. So here, I'm gonna uh, pick up the Canon, put it on and see how it goes. She laughs at everything. She thinks I'm ridiculous. <laughs> Alright, sister, from another mister. Can you stand a few feet back for me? Let me see if I can get this. Alright, so I'm going to show you guys the autofocus. See that? See how it's following the face? That's with the Metabones adapter. See how that, that orange box is following her face? all over and finding the focus for me. Isn't that awesome? Look to the side for me, hun. So see, I'm moving it around and it'll find her, her face. 
So I know a lot of people had questions for me as to how well it would work. A brighter. That's at 1.3, guys. See that? It's finding focus that quick at 1.3. <laughs> nice! So you gotta find models who are good sports. They totally make the videos. I understand you guys watch the videos for them and not me. I'm okay with that. So now you guys have seen what uh, the Canon and the 55 can do. You guys, you know what, in all fairness I should do a 55 to show you the focus on it, to show you the difference. So I'm gonna do that real quick and shut up. And this is the Zeiss with the 55 on it. A7R2 at the 55 Zeiss. That's right. Aye aye, Captain. <laughs> Look right at me, hon. There we go. See, there's the eye autofocus. You guys see that? It finds that little box and puts it right on her eye. And there's only a delay because I have the playback function on. I'll show you guys, there's no delay. All right guys, so now you're gonna see what this thing looks like with no auto review on. That's a 42 megapixels, guys. So there's no lag, no, I mean, there's no lag or delay that would stop you from working. And that auto review is gonna be the same regardless if it's Zeiss or Metabones with Canon. So, have you enjoyed your time? Yes, I have. Ready to go back to Oahu? No. <laughs> I guess she's camping here. But uh, until next time, guys, keep shooting. Never give, up, never give up on your dreams. Find the right gear that works for you. I'm just trying to show, uh, show you options. And remember, you only have one chance to get it right. Talk to you later. You have to go like this. And you have to say bye. Bye. <laughs> okay, let's do that again. And remember, you only have one chance to get, to get it right. Talk to you later. Bye. Nice. Chicken dancer. She's the pretty girl with all the cameras. She's the photographer. I'm the model. You guys can stop watching now. Um, but, uh, um, oh, life feels better now. So, um, which one is this? I don't know. That's all you. I thought I'd give it a try. This is the 55 Zeiss. We're going to try this today versus the Canon 50 mil. Tony cap, by the way. <laughs> Only because I, the guy I bought it from, it didn't have a, um, he didn't have the lens cap, so I thought it wouldn't hurt to put the Sony cap on there, piss everyone off. What's that? I said lies. Lies? <laughs> Jeez, you're a hater too. No. <laughs> Jeez, Louise. Now my haters are modeling for me. She's a lot better looking than most of you haters, though. You guys still here? Hello. Talking to you. Hey guys, if you want to learn online with me, go to patreon.com slash Photography, and you will be able to continue this craziness online from anywhere on planet Earth with me. If you want to join me live, go to jasonlinear.com slash workshops, and you'll get to see me in my full glory live and in person, guys. I think there's a smudge on there. Yeah, I got it. Talk to you later, guys. Bye.